Okay, this is your video for how to apply your rubber cement to your watercolor resist. Um, first, you're gonna start out with a bottle of rubber cement, just like this one, and you'll notice that inside of this bottle, there is a brush on the end, okay? That brush is not to be brushed on the paper as you are doing this process. It is to be drizzled on to this project. Now, right now I'm trying to get, there's a glob of rubber cement on the end of this. So I'm trying to get it off so that we can begin. All right, so first thing you'll do is you will dip your rubber cement brush into the rubber cement. And you'll notice that I've got kind of a, um, I can't really see it very well, but a drizzle going on right there in the corner. Um, that's what you want. So I'm going to take that drizzle and I'm going to lay it on the page and I'm going to outline all my lines by dragging this little drizzle across the paper. Okay, when it runs out, get more. All right, so next one, I'm going to go across here. Now understand that if you screw up and you need to redo, that's fine. You can just wait for it to dry and you can continue on. Um, you know, doing other areas while you're waiting for it to dry. But then once it's dry, you can come back in and you can rub off what didn't work out. Okay. So. Okay, I'm just pulling it around. You wanna do the entire drawing like this until the entire thing is covered in rubber cement. I mean, all the lines are covered in rubber cement, rather. Okay, and if you happen to get a little drizzle that is in the wrong spot, you can, like I said, rub that off. But sometimes, you know, you'll have to see what it looks like. You might actually like the way it looks. Um, and sometimes those little drizzles look good. It just kind of depends where it is, how big it is, you know, where it came out. Um, and notice right here, I kind of missed the line a little bit. That's okay. Um, if you're not dead on, that line still will exist and I can paint over these others. So you just want to go through and do all the lines until the whole thing is completed and that's it.